what's up guys welcome to my channel in today's video we got an ac fuse ac fuse keeps blowing so uh you swap a fuse it works for a little while and it blows again so there's an issue so first of all um this video will show you how to diagnose this check a few things other than that you got to attempt it on your own vehicle so let me tell you a little bit of story about a, a car chrysler 300 the fuse kept on blowing it was my friend's car he did uber and limousine so what he did was he became an owner of the company he really didn't work no more but he chilled in his car all day long and for hours and hours his ac fuse kept on blowing i'm talking about he would run the ac for hours and hours all day long at the end of the day well, because you're abusing it that's what happened there but a few things you want to do if your fuse keeps blowing so i have a car here this is a honda accord here so the fuse uh kept the blowing on this baby and in today's video this is just a sample tool so i can make a good thumbnail out of it so the fuse is in here it keeps blowing after a little while so what i discovered here was uh so pretty much you're gonna have to do a little bit of electrical diagnostic one thing you want to do is uh, you see the ac compressor here so it has a clutch a magnetic clutch down there so that clutch when it shorts itself um your ac is not gonna work but if your ac does work and then it blows it could be there's too much pressure in the system first of all the compressor is jamming up or there's a short somewhere you're gonna have to retract the wire and check for ground shorts to the ground i'll show you a little bit of diagram as well but what i did in this case was i disconnected um the connector down here just to diagnose this i disconnected the connector just like that and what i did was once it was disconnected i left it hanging and i because what i did was i put the fuse in immediately it will blow as soon as you put the ac on because that compressor there is shot in our case the clutch the magnetic coil inside this little guy right here there's a coil in it becomes a magnet and then it grabs so when this is spinning when it becomes magnetic this whole thing spins together okay like that instead of just a pulley if you see it spinning that's normal this has got to be engaged for the ac to work so this will provide power it grounds it, it's already grounded so that's what you're gonna do just to check but let's go on to the diagram right now so here it is uh diagram on this uh, cord uh four cylinder so here it is this is a fuse that kept on blowing right over here 7.5 amp so pretty much do you see this the compressor clutch if it fails if you even your compressor is jammed up it's gonna psh, blow this circuit here this circuit could be shorted out but what i did was see this disconnector to this compressor i disconnected it and the fuse never blew okay so that means this compressor right here was the cause it could be jammed most likely the the magnetic coil has shorted itself uh, there's other fuses like this relay there's a 30 amp fuse uh 7.5 amp i'm sorry there's a third number 30 fuse 7.5 amp so this if this this can blow too this can be a reason uh of a bad relay shorted in the circuit uh it could be a lot of reasons okay but common issue right here so like i was telling you about my friend his vehicle kept on blowing this fuse and because he ran this thing all day long the 7.5 amp fuse is gonna blow because it's it's gonna it's gonna uh, overdrawing amperage through this fuse is gonna blow it and that could be that compressor is kind of uh is 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 working too hard and this fuse might just give up anyways um you don't want to just keep putting fuse because it could be uh dangerous do take care of it but anyways thank you for watching my video hopefully this helps you guys out don't forget to subscribe share and like and give it thumbs up